Hello, this is Breuer, and welcome back to another episode of our Let's Play for Football Manager 2023 as we continue our Road to Glory run with Banbury United FC in the Premier League. Today we're going to get to see West Ham again after the last episode. Hopefully we can get a good result today. Uh, we have done pretty good since the last episode. We'll get into that as well. Nothing crazy has happened in the transfer window as of yet, and we're running out of time, so I don't know that we're going to get anything to happen at all uh, but we'll discuss that a little bit as well let's get into the episode all right here we are as you can see we did go out against stoke and whooped up on them three to nothing we got a pair of goals from larabee and a goal from amshoff in that go good stuff there uh, we then went up against Sheffield United. I don't know what it is with Sheffield United and Brentford here. Um, but, yeah, we just, we struggled. We struggled big time. Uh, we did get an injury against Larrabee, like, very, very late. Uh, thankfully, Amshoff was able to get the 80-minute goal to save the draw against Sheffield United. And then against Brentford, a whole lot of nothing happened in this game. So another draw. But points. Points are points, right? We've talked about that before. I, if I'm coming into these games, I would have said these are pointable games. And it's exactly what we got. Points. So, can't argue too much, I suppose. Although, I do think we should have at least won one of those um, based on how we played overall. But, it's okay. We did what we did, and I'm glad we didn't lose anything there. Uh, we then went up against Eastleigh in the FA Cup. Uh, beat them 5-2. to two. Uh, We did have a hat trick from Fine, a goal from Prosser, and apparently one of their guys got an own goal in the 91st minute. So, whoop-de-do there. Uh, looks like Fine actually... I actually sent him this game, so I didn't watch this one, just for to be clear. <laughs> Fine did miss a penalty in this game, so... Um, I've played every other game, but I simmed the Eastleigh FA Cup because I'm just like, who cares? Um, but today, again, we're playing at West Ham. Obviously, last time we did beat them 2 to nothing away from home, so hopefully we're going to get another victory today at home. Uh, we then play Liverpool, who we drew second game of the season before we'd even really gotten our feet under us. So I would hope for a reasonably good game here against Liverpool, similar to how we played uh, against Newcastle after drawing against them. So we'll see what we can do against Liverpool, although it is away from home, so probably going to be a tougher game. Honestly, if we can get the victory against West Ham and lose to Liverpool by no more than a goal, I, I will call that a victory. So I, I, I'll give them the fact that they could probably beat us away from home. You know, I mean, it's their stadium, and they're a pretty good team, right? What are they? I was going to say they're fifth or fourth, actually, so not bad. Um, as of right now, we are currently in eighth place. Uh, we do have a game in hand... Against a couple people, but nothing too crazy here. More than likely, we would not be able to pass Aston Villa. Obviously, we'd have to get four goals here coming up. So, I don't know. We're just, just outside that qualifying spot. So, But hey, I, we're, we're up here in the top 10. I, I, I'm not going to complain about anything else beyond that. That is perfectly fine by me. Uh, as far as transfers, uh, we do have a couple things going on. Nothing, Like I said, nothing crazy. So, Spagnoli, uh, we offered him a contract. He... Uh, he was okay with the contract in one sense, but he did also have an offer from Real San Sebastian for end of, of for his end of contract, and he decided to go with them. So we're not going to get any money from him, but we are going to get to keep him until the end of the season. So I think that's okay. I thought about selling him early, but honestly, I do actually want to keep him until the end of the season. We don't have a lot of guys that can play on that right-hand side very well, and so I think he's worth keeping around. Um, we're trying to sell Owen here. I think we've got a contract for 1.9 mil, which is basically what we thought he was worth, uh, which is fine. We actually have several guys that can play central defender, so... I'm okay with getting something for him. He wants to be sold. Uh, so that's going to be fine. Uh, we've had a couple offers here for loans for Campbell. And one of them here against Paris for Paris FC, I I was this close to going for, right? They actually offered $18 million. They wanted to take, bring him on loan, but they were going to give us like $18 million total in, in future fees for him to, to kind of come on board. And honestly, I would have been okay with that. I gambled and pushed up to 19 mil. I didn't think that was that big of a deal. And they then they immediately came back with a counter offer of 15 mil. And I'm like, you got to be kidding me. And I couldn't get them back to that 18 mil even. So uh, they rejected, they pulled out their their uh, request. And I mean, I guess they just didn't like the fact that I countered. I don't, it seems a little bit weird, but I would have probably sold them for 18 mil. Um, but it is what it is. If we can sell them, we can sell them. If not, not, we can't, not a big deal. We'll figure it out as we move along. Uh, so like I said, nothing really else is crazy going on. Uh, obviously we still know about boys on that was, that one's been there forever. Uh, we're trying to get us a new scout because one of our scouts did in fact retire and that's it. Like I said, nothing really crazy going on. Um, uh, Campbell's the only person I would be willing to sell right now. 
because he's the only one that's worth anything that's worth the effort. Uh, I mean, Fletcher is somebody who we're going to be playing a lot less of. And so I probably would, I mean, in one sense, he'd be less of a loss to us than Campbell on that attacking midfield on the right-hand side. But Campbell's worth, potentially worth something. Uh, so if we can get somebody to come in for a 20 mil offer, cool. If not, then honestly, we'll just keep Campbell and probably be happy with it for now. I mean, I, I don't have anything against Campbell at all. I just want to see if I can get anything for him. This is really what it all came down to. So here is the team we're bringing today for our game against West Ham. Uh, we got Watson go, Boyson on the left, Jonathan on the right, Stevens Warner in the middle, Feezy, Theodore, Nick Jonas across the uh, defensive midfield, Amshoff on the left wing, Layane on the right wing, and Fine up front. Uh, fine up to 11 goals now. Layane and Amshoff, nine between the two of them. That's pretty awesome as well, actually. Uh, but let's go. I really feel like we need this result here against West Ham. This is the type of team that... I would say this is not even a pointable game. This is this is a game that we should be we should be winning based on how we've played against them in the past. So I would say this is a winnable game. And then the second game that we play against Liverpool is a pointable game, but barely pointable game. Like I, if we don't come away with the point, I won't be super disappointed, but I think we can come away with a point. Oh, uh, come on guys, let's get a good game here. This is a home game, so this would be the type of game that we really want to you know, show our fans some loyalty by, by winning in front of them. First highlight comes in for West Ham. There's Amshuff picking up with that from that, uh, that kick forward. There's a uh, fine with the ball. Oh, good try. Good try. Fine. Corner kick coming in from fine. Come on. Yeah, I was going to say, he's in the area. Mourner's in the area. Or, yeah, that's Mourner. Mourner was in the area, but goalkeeper was able to get to it first. Corner kick coming from Amshoff. There's Mourner. Not able to get enough of that. I think he got a little bit of on it, maybe. Hard to tell. Easy able to pick this one up. We do have two yellow cards already in this game, which is unfortunate to see. Theodora back to Stevens. Stevens gets it up. There is fine to make it a good move. Oh, how do you miss that? Oh, how do you miss that, buddy? Come on. Oh, come on. Watch, watch your backs, guys. Oh, guys. Don't know what that was. Wait. Who was playing him on? Was it him? Didn't look like him. I don't know. I mean, I guess he was on sides, but it did not look... It didn't look like he was. Boyson with the ball. We got to get another goal back before halftime. Come on, guys. Gets it up to Amshuff. Amshuff over to Fine. Oh, my goodness. What is going on? Fine. I mean, I get he was off sides, but he still... I mean, he still hasn't even hit the broad side of a barn today. Uh, we're going to go ahead and demand more. Guys, come on. Like, <laughs> five shots, one on target is not good enough. Like, seriously, nothing? Wow. We are just fell asleep or something. I don't know what's going on today. Come on, guys. Stevens down to Amshoff. Amshoff just gets to take it away immediately. Immediately take it away. Yeah, we're... Uh, all right, Prosser. I was going to get him out at halftime. I saw that he was a bit injured, but I was going to get... Hopefully he could stay out until halftime. Okay, well, that's going to be painful to have that. Yeah, we definitely got to be better in front of Galga, guys. Come on. Corner kick coming in from Theodoru. Oh my goodness, another miss. <laughs> ah! Mm, I'll wait till the 60 minute mark to do a sub. We've already had one stoppage, so we've only got two here. So we'll do a set at 60 and probably a set at probably 75 or something like that. All right, 
let's get some guys in here. I mean, we got to get some of these yellow cards out. I'm sure would be a good idea. Look, what is going on? L uh, Liane 6.0. Yeah, our guys are just playing really, really poorly today. We have an O in the last hurrah here. Fine. Just, I don't know what's going on with him today. I just don't know. I'd like to get yellow cards out, but these other guys are playing worse. I mean, Liane, like seriously, basically has fallen asleep, apparently. You know what? We're going to bring Spagnoli in here. Yeah, I'm going to bring Spagnoli in here. Because I'm going to save Campbell for potentially coming in as a striker for us. I know that Spagnoli can play up there. I've, I have played them. It's been a while, but I have played them up there before. Come on, guys. Oh, that was a dangerous pass, VZ. No look pass there. Prosser, wait, good good move there, Prosser. Come on, buddy. Keep it going. Ah, oh, bad move there. He had it good for a moment, and then just... Didn't, I, I don't think he really had anybody to pass it to. The guy, uh, I guess it was fine, still in the middle. I don't think he was really in a good spot. Boysen gets it up to nobody. Stevens downs to Jonas. Jonas gets tripped up. Come on, red card. Uh, second yellow, so he is out. Uh, so that means we should be going in a little bit more attacking here. Um, let's go. Last couple of subs. Okay, definitely got to get fine out of here. Camel's going to have to come in for him. And uh, let's bring somebody in for you, Higgins. And then we're also going to go... We're going to get stuck in. I mean, we're man up, so I kind of feel like we can uh, afford to be a little bit adventurous here. Or maybe not. There we go. There's Boysen with the ball. At least we're getting a highlight. Stevens up to Higgins. Higgins just gets tripped up big time. He's trying to get it back. He's not doing it. There we go. There's Theodore. Up to Prosser. Prosser to Campbell. Campbell back to Nick Jonas. Up to Prosser. Prosser has a chance. Cannot hit anything. Ugh. Jonathan gets another chance here. Up to Spagnoli. Spagnoli back to Jonathan. And that's the end of that highlight. Seriously. I mean, we are getting so royally FM'd today. We have a 2.07 XG. They've had... One shot on target and it's a goal. We are getting so FM today. This is, this is, I mean, it's hard for me to blame the team. This is not the team's fault. FM got us. Prosser. Ah, at least we're going to get the draw, but we deserve the win. This team has just been getting robbed today. Do we have enough left in us to get one more? Prosser, buddy, come on. Ah, come on, guys. Yeah, we got... We got... Ah. It's, just, it's not right. It's just not right. We've played so hard this season and to draw a game like this that we absolutely deserve to win. Absolutely deserve to win. Oh, well. I mean... It's a point. I um, mean, if we can go out and get a result against Liverpool, even just a draw, that will save a little bit of that, and I'll feel a little bit better about that. A bunch of people looking for loan deals for Campbell, which is interesting. Nobody wants to buy him outright. Nope, 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 nope. None of these are good. Nope, 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 nope. Sorry, nope. All of them knows. None of them are high enough. I'm sorry. Sorry, guys. The price is 20 mil. He's worth 10 mil for me to keep him. Gash lower leg. Oof. I cannot believe we drew that game. Uh, thanks for us, Prosser, for saving our bacon there, but my goodness. We got six unbeaten. That's not bad. All right, we'll be right back for our game against Liverpool. It's going to be a tough game. Again, you know, I only want to draw more now because I want to try and save a little bit of, you know, <laughs> pride on this episode, I guess. Um, oh, that'd be nice if they give me 4.8 mil. Um, but honestly, coming into this game, I, 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 like I said before, a loss by no more than a goal would be would be fine. So we'll be right back. 
All right, we're back for our game against Liverpool here. Uh, the fans expect a loss. The board expects a loss. The the uh, media expects a loss. We're, we're probably going to lose, uh, especially considering we don't have a attacking midfielder on the left-hand side today. Uh, all three of ours are injured. Amshoff, Durant, and Prosser. All three injured. What are the odds? Uh, so here's the team we're bringing. We got Watson go, Boyson on the left, Jonathan on the right, Fabio and Mourner in the middle, Casey Higgins and Nick Jonas across the defensive midfield. Stevens is going to come in here and try to hold down the fort. I mean, he can play on the left-hand side as a defender. We'll see what he can do as an inside forward uh, with Layane Le, uh, on the right-hand side and a fine ahead of him. Again, ideally, we don't get embarrassed, but given we're playing a guy out of position, embarrassment might just be what has to happen. I mean, it's a good team, so it is what it is, but let's see what we can do here. Still no news to talk about on the uh, transfer front. I mean, Owen left, but we uh, we already talked about him, so nothing really there. Oh, this is the team that's got Enric. Yes, Liverpool. Liverpool with Enric. Enric is very, very good. All right, let's go. Let's go. No idea. I, I, we have three guys that can play attacking midfielder on the left-hand side. Normally, that should be plenty. <laughs> it's just not not this year. There's Enric right there. Come on, guys. Good takeaway fine. What was that? Where did that come from? I didn't know fine was a defender. Jonathan, come on, guys. I mean, we're trying. I'll give you guys some credit. Le uh, Leanne, I'm here. Oh, don't give it up there, buddy. You can't just be sitting there waiting. Like, you can't be doing that. You gotta actually like everybody else is trying. You've got to clear that one out. I mean, we're we're defending, but they're still coming. Like this is not over. This highlight is not over. I was gonna say it's not gonna be over till they score at this point. Like we we did everything we could, and then eventually they're just gonna score. I mean, it's just inevitable at that point. Stevens with the ball. Back to Boyson. Over to Higgins. Higgins gets it up to Fine. Fine. Sneaks it through to Layane. Layane just couldn't quite get it past the guy in front of him. We're going to get a corner kick here. I mean, this is how we want to score these so that we can get back in this game here. Mourner. <laughs> oh, did I call it or did I call it? And just like that, we're back in the game. Man, good stuff. Another highlight already. I said Indri Indri I think I said Enric. Indrick with a D. Indrick. Fabio with the ball now. Gets it over to Boyson. Boyson back to Fabio. Fabio across to Moiner. Moiner, the super guy for today so far. Layane back to Moiner. Up to Higgins. Higgins back to Fabio. All the way across to Boyson. Boyson pushing the ball up. Don't have a lot of help. There we go. There's Feezy. Feezy gets it across to Higgins. Higgins got some guy behind. Watch out. Uh, watch out, guys. There's Mourner. Push it up to Jonas. Jonas up to Leanne. Leanne got it. Oh, how did he miss it? I thought he, I actually thought he had that one. He looked like he was in a good spot. I actually thought he had that one. Uh. Oh, you think we should play uh, Stevens in a more familiar position, huh? <laughs> yes. I don't disagree. Then tell me, who, are you going to go out there and play, uh, Mr. Assistant Manager? Are you going to play attacking midfielder on the left for me? Come on. No, don't get Indrick that chance. He's just so fat. Oh, guys. Fabio. Like, here's the deal, guys. Liverpool does not need our help. Giving them free penalty shots is not, not the right way to do this. Okay, it's just not. Oh, no penalty. Okay, then. I mean, we still got to defend this, and we've seen them score on this before, I believe. Warner, good defense there, but they're going to chase it right back down again. Come on, guys. Oh, my goodness. I mean, we defend well, and then we give them an easy shot, right? We defend, 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 easy shot. 
Oh my goodness. Wish we had easy shots like that. <laughs> This, that was just dumb play. I think both these guys went after the same guy and just let it sneak. There was just, it's just a little bit of a dumb play. I mean. Jonas with a free kick. Feezy, not able to get that one down. Another highlight here. Oh, there you go, Feezy. Good job. Poison with the ball. Across to Morner. Morner up to Jonas. Jonas, good move. Oh, back to Higgins. Stevens with the ball. Gets tripped up. Not able to do anything with that. I mean, he's not really a, a dribbler, is he? <laughs> We're making him do something he's not supposed to do. All right, good good defense there, Watts. Let's not give Augustin his hat trick till the second half. Oh, good good move, Lagane. Come on, come on, come on. Go, 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 go. Doesn't have a lot. Oh, Throw him out, throw him out, throw him out. Augustine, get him out of here. <laughs> uh. You know what? Show me something better in the second half. I like that. I like that. We're not, we were actually not playing poorly. We let through a couple of easy goals, but otherwise we've looked halfway decent. There's Higgins with a good takeaway. Fine to Stevens. Back to, or yeah, Stevens still got the ball. Over to Boysen. Boysen pushing the ball up. He's got five finds. Ah, not able to get the shot off. He had too big of a, too heavy of a, of a first touch there. And it just wasn't able to get back to it. Now we're getting embarrassed. Now it's done. And at least we waited until the second half to give Augustine his hat trick. Honestly, until these last two goals, I didn't think we looked that bad. But, uh, but we are. Um, let's see here. I mean, I don't even know at this point. Yeah, sure. I'd love to get Stevens out of here. You know what we're going to do? We are going to get Stevens out. We're going to bring in... We're going to bring Campbell over there, I think. Because he's at least a striker. And we're kind of playing inside forward as a striker, right? So we're going to bring Campbell over there. Um, in place of fine, we're actually going to put Larry B up there. Jonathan's just not playing well. We're going to bring Spagnoli in. And we'll go with that for now. I mean, I don't know that there's anything left to get out of this game. I mean, we'll go up a little bit more positive, try to get something back here, and we will go ahead and uh, get stuck in here. Just just try to get something. I don't think there's a chance, but you never know. All right, last couple subs here. We'll go ahead and get Feezy out, bring Theodoro in. And we will get da, 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 da. voice out probably. Angeli can come in, sure. All right, guys. I mean, we fought good in the first half, and then just kind of gave it up in the second. So, really, not much else to say other than that. Good takeaway, Campbell. Come on, buddy. Uh, that's not how we're going to get less embarrassed here. <laughs> Another takeaway by Campbell. Dude, maybe you have been uh, attacking midfielder on the left-hand side this whole time, and we just didn't know it. Oh! Oh, my.
my goodness. How do we... Anyway, <laughs> we missed that. What in the world? Another missed shot. My goodness. Look, okay. Did Liverpool deserve to win this? 100%. Absolutely deserve to win this. But I think the scoreboard looks worse than the game actually was. Um, I I will give the guys a bit of credit. I mean, we just couldn't get shots on target. We just couldn't get them on target. See, I was worried about that. My assistant manager is an idiot. No, I'm just kidding. Um, I mean, it is what it is. I, I, I'm trying to be nice to the guys because I really thought they did okay. Just gave up a couple stupid goals. But apparently we can't be nice. We got to be mean. We got to yell them next time. All right. Hope, let's hope that that's not the beginning of our downfall here. Um, uh, yeah. All right. Next game you guys are going to see. I'm probably going to skip over February. Because there's really nothing to watch here in Arsenal Man City. I mean, yeah, don't get me wrong. We did uh, draw against Man City last time, but I don't want to show us getting destroyed by Arsenal again. So we'll probably come down here at Southampton, maybe. Probably Fulham and Southampton. A couple pointable games. I don't think the Man City or Man United is a pointable game for us. So yeah, we'll probably show those two. And uh, that'll be that. Um, still, I mean, we got to be proud of ourselves, right? We're in a good spot. Top 10. I mean... Anything above top 17 is, is a win for us this season. So I do appreciate you guys watching, though. May God bless you, and I hope you join me again next time. Thank you, and goodbye. I wanted to give a special shout-out to the following channel members. Thank you so much for supporting the channel.